Scientists in South Africa are using innovative ways to save rhinos from extinction by increasing their population. For decades, the number of rhinos has been dwindling at an alarming rate. Poaching and loss of habitat are among top threats to endangered species. Reporting from Cape Town, CDTN's Travis Andrews now tells us how scientists are working to turn that around. Rhinos continue to be a leading tourist attraction in many African countries, including South Africa. But they are also under threat. Poachers kill them for their wounds. Their numbers have been declining across the continent. To reverse this alarming trend, veterinarians in South Africa are using assisted forms of reproduction to help increase rhino numbers. By using artificial insemination, in vitro fertilization and embryo transfers, veterinarians are successfully using science to stimulate the reproductive process. Growing a rhino in a, in a laboratory is uh, test tube babies like what they do in humans and, uh, and also with induced pluripotent stem cells is using uh, a little piece of the ear and then you grow um, a cell culture from that. You then make a stem cell from that cell culture. That stem cell then can be manipulated into becoming an embryo. That embryo then goes and be implanted into a surrogate mother. At the heart of these techniques is the successful use of surrogate mothers to carry the embryos to full term, using rhinos from a different subspecies that have higher numbers. Both the BioRescue and Rhino Repro organizations have been at the forefront of these assisted reproduction programs and they say their efforts have been a success so far. With less than a handful of animals left, the northern white rhino is functionally extinct as a species. However, conservation groups have turned to in vitro fertilization in order to pull the species away from the brink of extinction. By using surrogate mothers from a different subspecies of rhino, veterinarians though are hoping to grow a sustainable population in the future. The western black rhino is totally extinct in the wild um, and almost in the world today. So the northern white rhino is a subspecies, obviously but barring the two females that are in Old Pejeta in Kenya and um, you know, the, uh, the the semen that's been stored in San Diego has been kept on ice and these scientists that are trying to implant eggs into, into the female southern white rhinos, which are more abundant. For now, it may be too late to use assisted reproduction to save species such as the western black rhino. But by utilizing this technology successfully, veterinarians are beginning to increase the gene pool in southern Africa. Travis Andrews, CGTN, Cape Town.